because people were putting their fractions on their number line, that a lot of people wrote down equivalent fractions. So ways to write the same fraction, like 16 sixteenths and 8 eighths for one. Why would we ever want to know equivalent fractions? Think of a reason that we would ever want to know an equivalent fraction in real life. Layla, what do you think? Okay, why would a, an equivalent fraction help? Because uh, you said we were either going to buy a box of eight yeah. or an eight out of eight pieces or a box of 12. Okay. 12 pieces. Okay. And they're the 12 ones are going to be smaller, but they're going to like equal to the eight. In terms of a whole. In terms of, yeah. Okay. Can anyone else think of a reason that we might want to know an equivalent fraction in real life? I'm thinking of a reason that actually had to do the other day with our measuring activity that we did outside. When I come into the classroom and I had broken the measuring spoon that we needed, how could an equivalent fraction have helped me with that tablespoon that I now no longer had access to. Basil? Yeah? <coughs> okay. So, no matter what kind of activity you're doing, if it's this when you're working on a number line, if it's when you're using the little fraction strips, if it's when we're solving the issue with the sub like we did the other day, it's important to know why we might want this skill so we can figure out if or when we would actually use this particular tool. Raise your hand if you enjoyed using the number line as an option to see fractions. Who found that helpful? Okay. If you found it helpful, tell me why. Why did you think it was helpful for seeing the fraction? Ali, why did you think it was helpful? Just like yeah. How did you figure out how to divide it into smaller groups? Like, even though most of the number lines were four tiles, some were two tiles. But how did you figure out how to divide it into, say, eighths or sixteenths? What did you do? Ella? Um, well, first we put down half, which was like the most simple one. Yeah. So we kind of like used that to help us see where the next one is. Okay. Did anyone do anything different with their tiles to figure out how to, say, break the four tiles into eighths or into sixteenths? I saw your group do something different. Yeah. How did you break your four tiles into twelfths? Yeah? And why did you do that? Okay, but why did putting three numbers in one help you do twelfths? Right.